Well, a man who helped save the life of Houston, lives of Houstonians by founding the emergency medical service system has died. Family and friends are mourning the loss of Lester Whitey Martin, a man who lived and fought to help others. He loved the fire department. He, he died. He devoted a lot of his life to it. Lester Martin fought a lot of fires during his 39 years as a Houston firefighter, but perhaps his biggest battle was establishing emergency medical service in the fire department back in the early 70s. They picked him because he was kind of tough. <laughs> And uh, he went through quite a bit. The city was concerned about the deterioration of private ambulance transportation in the 60s. A study commissioned by city officials suggested firefighters provide emergency medical service and transportation to hospitals. The approval followed quickly, and Martin was chosen to head the operation. Although Martin had the support of then-Mayor Louis Welch, opposition quickly grew. Martin battled the private ambulance companies that would soon lose their lucrative business. In the end, Martin won out and established the new section of the fire department, which would become a model for the rest of the country. I always made him proud that uh, he could help the citizens, you know, in their day-to-day -day activities and cut down a little bit of suffering in the world. Funeral services for Martin will be held on Thursday at Forest Park Lawndale Funeral Home. Well, it is